Hello, welcome back to Dry Creek Beekeeping. So today I'm going to be looking at the Ada and the Epsilon hives and just seeing how they're doing. For the Ada hive, this will be the first time that I actually check on it. So I just want to make sure that the queen is alive and healthy. And with the Epsilon hive, I want to make sure that they've actually been expanding. All right, checking on the Ada hive here first. It looks like they haven't drank all their sugar water. There's still quite a bit in here. I'm really hoping that I can actually find the queen of the five and then be able to mark her. That's the ideal, but I don't know how likely it is. It's been four weeks since I actually made this hive split and obviously they haven't made any progress because they haven't had a queen. When they don't have the have a queen they don't want to expand. All right, this frame doesn't have much in it. Just a lot of capped honey. I only have three frames to look at here, so this is gonna be pretty quick. Uh, hey, let's go. This frame actually does have some larva in it. That's good. I'm gonna look for the queen on this frame. Hopefully I can find her. It also has some eggs in it as well, which is good to see. All right, I'm not seeing her on this frame. I'll take a look at the next frame. All right, she's not, a, oh, yes she is. I found her. Where'd she go? Caught her. All right, so they were successful in making a new queen in this hive and I was successful in catching her. Now I'm gonna go ahead and mark her. I don't exactly remember what color uh, to mark the queen. I don't think it matters that much. I mean, a lot of beekeepers do mark them for the year, but I have so few hives that it's like not a big deal. I got her in the cage here. I'm going to slowly bring the cage up to her, if she'll get on the right part of it. Slowly and carefully. Now she's like that, see? She's got one of her workers checking on her. And now, I'm just going to mark her. And there we go, the queen is marked. So now I'll go ahead and free her back into the hive. It's good to know that the queen of this hive is marked, so that way she'll be easier to find in the future. And yeah, that's all I really need to see with this hive. It's good that they're doing good. All right, now moving on to the Epsilon hive, and we'll see what we can see here. It looks like they drank all of their sugar water, so I'm going to have to get a new sugar water jar for them. Oh, hey, look at that. They've actually expanded a little bit onto this frame here. It's good to see. Don't see any eggs or anything on this frame. Definitely don't see the queen. So, they got some good stores here. It's good to see. I would love to find the queen of this hive as well today, but if I'm not able to, then I'm not able to. It is what it is. This frame has some brood and some eggs on it. Oh wow, this one has a lot of brood on it. That is good to see. All right, I don't see the queen on this frame. I mean, she very well could be on this frame and I'm just have terrible eyesight, but I don't know. Well, once again, I'm not seeing the queen. So I'm just gonna call it and move on. I'm not even gonna bother. I know the queen is doing fine in this hive. They had plenty of uh, brood and eggs. So yeah, that'll be that for looking at the Epsilon hive. It looks like they've started expanding out to these two frames, but again, not that much expansion. That's not entirely surprising. It takes a while for them to actually start building up the population. 
once you split them. All right, so to recap what I saw and what I did here today, I took a look at the Ada and the Epsilon hives. Both of them are doing well. The Ada hive, uh, that's the first time I checked on it. And it's good to see they were successful in making a queen. And I was actually able to mark the queen, which that's very good because that'll make it easier to find her in the future. In coming weeks and months, I expect them to start expanding quicker, but they're just a little bit slow right now just because they are brand new, they don't have much brood, the population is still low, stuff like that. I'll check on them in another two weeks, see how they're doing. But yeah, that's that. Thank you for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please make sure to like, subscribe, leave a comment, and I'll see you guys in the next video.